Number 1. Munktelmuseet. Heavy machinery is the subject at this museum in Munktelstaden, Eskilstuna's industrial quarter. The setting is a preserved factory, owned by Volvo and where manufacturing took place from the 19th century until the 1970s. A lot of the museum's machines were produced by Munktel's Mechaniska Werkstad, a company that, after various mergers, would eventually become part of Volvo. Number 2. Parken Zoo. On the edge of town, Parken Zoo mixes animal attractions with an amusement park. The zoo's inhabitants are organized according to continents, and there's also a little zoo, Lilla Zoo. This bit is for youngsters and has creatures like rabbits, miniature horses, and harmless reptiles that kids can touch and interact with. Number 3. Redemitures Majorna. Eskiltuna's forging industry was born in this district in the 17th century. The man who kick-started it was one Reinhold Rademacher, a Dutch industrialist from Riga in modern Latvia. Today 15 of the forges that he founded to produce locks, hinges, knives, scissors, nails and tools for King Gustav X are still intact in Eskilstuna. Number 4. Gamla Staden. It threads through the old town on the east bank of the river and is hemmed by painted wooden houses and has cramped little alleys to beckoning you to the sides. This cobblestone lane is made for walking and pottering around little art galleries, vintage shops, and cafes. One street across is the riverside where there's a string of restaurants on the water. Number 5. Sigurdsristningen. Set a course for the idyllic shore of Lake Melloren 10 kilometers outside Eskilstuna, where you'll come to an incredible Viking inscription evoking the Sigurd saga. This isn't strictly a runestone as the pattern has been etched into a slab of flat rock on the ground. Dating to the 1000s the image is very complex and Norse scholars are able to decipher an entire story about Sigurd the dragon slayer from it. Number 6. Eskilstuna Stads Museum. At the city museum on the river you can into more depth about Eskiltuna's industrial heritage. The old mechanical workshop is a cave of wonders for engineers, heaving with metalworking machinery, while there's also a hall for steam engines collected from factories around the city. In 2017 there's also a special show for the city's weapons manufacturers, with a spectacular display of swords and knives forged in Eskiltuna from the 18th century to 1940. Number 7. Kloster Skirka. Impossible to miss beside the Eskilstunen River, Kloster Skirka is the largest church in the city and has an almost overwhelming scale for a city of Eskilstuna's size. This brick edifice is also more recent than it might look, having only been completed in 1929. Above the main portal is an image of St. Eskil, an 11th century English missionary in the old village of Tuna. He met with a bloody end after interrupting a Norse pagan ritual. Number 8. Eskilstuna Konst Museum. Eskilstuna's art museum has been around since 1937, and in 2006 moved to the old Bollander Monktel Gearworks. This is a dynamic and well respected art institution, staging high profile temporary shows. In the permanent collection are works dating from the 17th century onwards with a focus on Swedish art movements in the 1900s like Expressionism and Modernism. Number 9. Furs Kirka. The city's oldest church dates back to the 11th century when it was a wooden Romanesque building. There are small traces of that original edifice in the north and west walls. The vaults in the nave are Gothic, from the 1300s, while the church got its present Baroque facade in the 17th century. A lot of the church's art is medieval, so you should go in and for a few minutes and see what you can find. Number 10. Vilsta. For some exercise in a pristine environment, there's a nature reserve in 400 hectares next to the Eskilstunen. On the river you'll have one of the city's main bathing areas, and this is complemented by indoor and outdoor sports facilities, big swathes of mature mixed woodland, barbecue facilities, a sauna, playgrounds and a campsite. Hope you like this video for more videos please subscribe to our channel.